When you live in an island country, you experience many disasters. Flooding, cyclones, tidal waves. Island countries in the Pacific face similar disasters to those in Caribbean island countries. In both regions, experts have set up systems and methods to plan for and deal with these disasters. In some cases though, these systems and methods are very different from one region to another. That's why the United Nations brought disaster experts from the Pacific to the Caribbean. And disaster experts from the Caribbean to the Pacific. These two regions, although they have differences, they also have many similarities. The goal was to share the best ideas from both regions to see if preparedness and response systems could be improved and if loss of life could be avoided. The result was the sharing of ideas and experiences on a broad scale. From methods to increase community involvement in disaster planning, to better coordination between national and community governments, to recognition of the unique roles of women and men before and after disasters. The lessons learned should help both regions. There's a whole lot of new information that has been brought back uh, from this visit. There's a lot that can be shared between what the Caribbean is doing in that regard. The cultures may be different, but there are similarities in the experiences based on culture. We sort of face the similar hazards. The topography is similar. And volcanic islands raised, um, vulnerable low-lying population. As the South-South Cooperation Project develops, Experts from both regions will continue to learn from one another and better prepare their regional and national organizations. Uh, we do have to acknowledge that there already are a lot of very obvious synergies. This, in turn, should help island communities better prepare for and respond to natural and man-made disasters. Because this is just the beginning, I think it has a lot of uh, potential, but we have to ensure that we do um, make good on that promise.